We had something happen at the White House today that's never, ever happened before in the Biden administration. It happened in the press briefing room in the White House. That's where communications director, Karine Jean-Pierre, usually takes questions from the press. But guess who else showed up today? President Joe Biden. Yep, Joe showed up. Now, the only time a president shows up in a briefing room is when he's got important things to say. And he had some important things to convey. But there's something else about this with Joe. Joe's no longer a candidate, so he's not under the restrictions of being a candidate. He can step up, talk proud and loud, and say what he wants to say. And I think he's relishing in that. And he talked about a couple of things. First of all, the port strike. Everybody was all upset about this. How is this going to affect the election? What's this going to do to the economy? What's going to happen? Well, it went three days. It's now been tentatively resolved, and they're going to deal with it in January of 2025. And make no mistake, Joe Biden and Kamala Harris were involved in those negotiations. They were responsible for getting this thing to end, taking away the potential problems to this country, should it be ongoing, and put it off past the election so there's no possibility of trying to pull some shit over the pull wool over the people's eyes for the election. This is going to go on after January, and that strike is over, at least tentatively for now. That's good news. Secondly, the jobs report came out for September, and it was a lot better than everybody expected. It was 245,000 jobs created last month or thereabouts. Joe Biden made a point to say that in his administration thus far, they've created 16 million jobs, and no other president in history has ever created that many jobs. Just remember, Donald Trump lost two and a half million jobs when he was the president, and no president has lost more jobs than Donald Trump. So these are some big things to talk about, some big things to crow about, if you will. He has the right. He accomplished it. Much to everybody's chagrin in the Republican Party, Joe Biden just keeps winning. So it's good news from Joe Biden. It's good to see Joe Biden feeling a little more free and easy and giving us the good news as we get closer to the election. There seems to be no question who to vote for, Democrats or Republican, success or failure. Fucking no-brainer.